What is going on guys? Shadow Beats here. The song that you just heard is called Pulse Ecstasy by yours truly, link in the description. And in this video, I will show you guys how to make that lead synth sound that you hear in a lot of electronic dance music. Namely, you know, the, the dance genre, but even in some dubstep uh, recently. It's a very versatile synth, and, well, <laughs> here we go. Uh, first thing that you want to do is, well, first thing I normally do is make a combinator in a line mixer 62. It's not really necessary, but just force a habit, and I'll probably show you why in a minute. But uh, I'm going to go down here. Um, I should say that this is Reason 6.5. However, you can make this patch in any version of Reason 4 or later. So this, the windows might be a little different looking, but you can, you can follow along. <laughs> OK, so create a Thor polysonic synthesizer. Open it up. And if it is not already initialized, just right click and hit reset device or initialize patch depending on what version you are using and it should all be good to go. So come down here to the oscillator section, make three multi oscillators, bring one up an octave, one down an octave, and set them all to the pulse uh, waveform. Detune them all to about 38, 40 or so and run them both through by clicking two and three and you should be sounding like this. And you can hear the thickness of it, but to make it a little more epic, in the low pass filter over here, turn the frequency all the way up. Down here in the amp envelope, turn the sustain all the way up. Turn on chorus, turn on delay, and again, you can adjust to taste, but as it sounds right now, it's pretty damn good. <laughs> I love this thing. And so, yeah, that's the, um, that is the basic foundation for how to get it working. Uh, but like I said, there's just a bunch of different effects that you can add to make it sound even bigger. For example, uh, if you duplicate device, so recreate it again, hit tab to look at the back, and link it up from the audio output of the Thor that you just duplicated put it up into the second channel of the mixer. This is why I like using mixers, by the way. Pan one to the left, pan one to the right in equal amount, and it just widens it up. And depending on, you know, how wide you want it. Uh, what else can you do? Oh, of course. <laughs> if you right click on the mixer, create a RV7000 advanced reverb, and you can dial it in in the auxiliary knob. You know, just add some reverb, make it sound even bigger. <laughs> Sounds pretty damn good. And you can put a beat under this, you can add some bass lines to it, and you got the makings of a pretty good dance song already. Like I said, not the most complicated synth in the world, but there's just so much that you can use with it. And like I said, also Reason has a whole bunch of effects that you can play with. You know, just toy around, make it your own. Um, it's pretty much... Oh, and I guess if you want to make the uh, effect of having it sound like coming up from underwater in the uh, epic build-up parts, it's as simple as... Well, I'm not going to be able to do it. Hold on, let me just draw in some notes. Okay, I have some notes put in there now. It's a really shitty melody. Don't judge me on that. But if you want to make the build-up sound, you'll know what I mean when I, when I actually do it. Just follow me. If you hit Show Programmer, click on the first Thor, set Rotary 1 to Filter 1 Frequency. Again, this is a lot, more, a lot less cluttered than Reason 4, but... Just find filter one frequency, set to rotary one, and do the same thing with the second one. And you'll hear once I start playing it. The rotary one is set to uh, both of the 
filter frequencies and when you want to build it up just right click rotary one draw in a little envelope and simple draw that in and you can see this rise up all by itself <laughs> epic I know well that's all I pretty much have to show you guys for uh, for right now if you use this synth please and you make a song uh, put it in a video response I'd love to hear what you guys can make with it and yeah that's, that's pretty much it <laughs> thank you for watching guys peace